Hello everybody, this is Terry Jeanette with the Tapping Flamingo and today we are going to be making, let's see, one, two, three, four pair of earrings using Jesse James Beads Pantone Dual Inspiration Mix in Illuminating and Ultimate Gray. So all these earrings kind of have the same feel to them, but they're a little different. They're all going to be, well, let's make the first one and I'll show you. So I'm just going to take a little tiny seed bead and I'm going to use one of the yellow faceted teardrops and we're going to add some wings so we're doing fairies or I guess you could call these um, angels. I like to think of them as fairies and I'll tell you why in just a little bit. The next bead I'm going to use for this first one is the little faceted yellow oval that matches the teardrop. And then I'm going to top it with a bead cap. So we're not really not talking a halo. We're talking just a little head thing on the fairy's head. And we need a little tiny sea bead to finish it. Cut this off a little bit. We almost have exactly what we need, but it's just a little bit too long. And there we go, our first pair of little fairy earrings. Aren't those sweet? Very happy. So this next pair of earrings, I'm going to use one of the hematite looking beads. First, we're going to put a little seed bead at the bottom. And then one of the yellow crystals. Oh, wait, got to add the wings. And these wings I just had from my stash. Now we need the head. And then one of the other little bead caps that was in the mix. It's her little hat. And then of course we're going to top it off with a seed bead. And hanging on an ear wire. Close her up. And we have the second pair of little fairy earrings. Or they could be angels. So for this next one, we're getting a little fancier here. Again, I put a little seed bead at the bottom of the head pin. And we're using one of these bigger yellow crystals. And then I'm going to use a bead cap for the top, like at the top of her dress there. And then now I've got some more of these wings that were in my stash. And then we need a head. So I'm just using a smaller yellow crystal. And then remember these little potato chip looking beads? I'm going to use this. We're putting a hat on her. And then one of these little crystals for the rim of her, the top of her hat. So like the chip is the rim. And then we're going to top it off with a little seed bead. Isn't she cute? And just make a loop and hang your ear wire. Oops. Open it up a little bit more.
Aren't these adorable? I love these. They look like they're wearing little hats. The last one, we're going to use this really pretty bead. Looks like it's got a little pearl in there. Already have the built-in bead caps. Again, I put a little seed bead at the bottom. By the way, I'm mixing my metals on a lot of these. Putting the bead on there. We've got our wings. Our little head. And our little topper. Finishing it off with another seed bead. These are so pretty. I love these beads. And there we have another pair of little fairy earrings, or if you like angels, they can be angel earrings. And angels are just not for Christmas. I think they look like little fairies though, aren't they pretty? So here's a little recap. We did some teardrop fairies, some hematite fairies, we got a little bit fancier and really fancy. Which one's your favorite? I don't know. My, it's a tie between these two. Maybe these, but I really like the little top hat that one's wearing. Let me know in the comment below which are your favorites. Hope you all have a fantastically wonderful day. This is Terry Jeanette with the Tapping Flamingo signing out for now. Bye-bye.